we're very proud of this. Uh, this is really uh, the latest manifestation of the state of the art, uh, what can be achieved with an LED press. Uh, and and it's, uh, whether it's a new machine with LED, whether it's a 10, 15 year old machine with LED, uh, you can start to work on these kinds of projects. And what this lookbook does is really show not only the vibrancy of the ink uh, on every different kind of substrate we can imagine, uh, but also special effects that are now achievable with the coatings and the varnishes that are also designed for LED. And it's a single pass, one LED lamp doing the whole work, and you're running at full production speeds without a single concern for marking or scratching or powder or other things that have traditionally been in the process. You can pile them high and go straight into your bindery to your customer. And so this, this lookbook really is what's uh, driving a lot of the interest in LED and just the sheer amount of, uh, of attention and, and uh, in incredible effects that we can do this. And we love doing this kind of work. So to talk a little bit more about the lookbook, and this is our LED lookbook version two. So we found uh, uh, the first version was last year at Drupa, and was really one of the most amazing pieces that uh, was at Drupa, I think, in, uh, and I'm, 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 I'm saying this from a point, that, point of view that uh, we're very proud of what we've done, uh, but really to showcase the state of what's possible with LED UV technology, and combined with the, the power level generation that we bring to the print market. And uh, so we were so excited to work on this new version. Uh, what you see in this booklet is all the effects that you can take advantage of now, state of the art with LED V printing on an offset machine. And in this particular case, this was a six color machine with a coder, an analox coder. And through the combination of the ink and the coating, uh, we can produce this spot effect or a drip off, uh, some people call strike through effect. And that's one of the most amazing things because it allows uh, sort of a feeling to come out on the sheets in addition to the, the brilliance of the ink on uh, multiple substrates. Uh, you can also begin to see how we're taking advantage of uh, in-register spot curing at a very, very low cost. Uh, it's rivaling some of the output that you see on some of these advanced dig digital enhancement machines uh, on the market, uh, such as a Skodex or an MGI, but you're doing this on an offset press. Uh, so ability to do in-register spot on a variety of different substrate types. Uh, we're also showing the range of materials. So as you go through this, this lookbook, you see some of the normal papers, uh, silk uh, coated papers, you see the nature papers or the uncoated offset papers, and just the density and the vibrancy that we can pull out of these, uh, these images. You, you see, as we move into the realm of plastics, so many printers are dealing with plastics in one form or another, whether it's a synthetic material, synthetic paper like a UPO, or whether it's the traditional plastics that you find in, uh, in films uh, for various uh, uh, sort of see-through uh, type applications. There's also been a lot of demand for, for papers that have a feeling like canvas or just a very rich feel that are coming out of the paper mills and uh, for art books uh, or other high value materials. Uh, several of our LED printers are the suppliers to the most famous museums in the world because of the quality and the brilliance of the LED. Uh, and so this is shown again through the, through the type of paper. Again, br bringing back uh, spot effects that can really enhance just subtle, subtle areas of an image. In this case, on the, on the Porsche, you see just on the grill and on the, name, uh, on the name tags and the plates, you see just a slight, subtle variation of the, of the light and the it effect. It almost looks like something that is popping out of the... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and you see watermarking ability, uh, so there's an ability to, for whether it's a security product or something, that you can bring in this, uh, this technology easily. The availability of, uh, of more advanced inks, so several years ago it was hard to find uh, inks that were true Pantone across all the ranges. And now we have neon inks, such as this green available. It really allows another level of effect. Uh, here you see an example of, a, of a, uh, something in a rainforest, but you see each individual droplet has a, has a spot effect to it, of bringing that, uh, that to life uh, in a way that uh, has sort of an emotional effect in addition to uh, and I, a I was just effect. about to put, pick up a napkin to, to wipe it off because yes, I thought exactly. it was wet, that, but that was not the case. And that's the idea. And it doesn't have to be screened on in an offline process. This is all done in line and single pass with one LED. Uh, you're just a security of cure. One of the things LED brings is a security feeling to the cure uh, because it's always on at the same power level. You never have to worry about the degradation of lamps. Uh, there's a also something, uh, just the efficiency. Uh, LED is, uh, is, is the most efficient energy drying technology, whether you compare it to tra traditional UV, whether you compare it to uh, IR hot air drying, there's nothing that, that will reduce the cost of energy consumption in the plant like an LED system. Uh, it's fresh. One of the other advantages, and a lot of our printers have remarked about this, there's no odor or smell uh, from the LED printing process. 
uh, because of the fact that you're not putting heat into the materials and you're not putting, uh, you're using a higher quality uh, LED ink and an LED coating that doesn't have the cheap materials in it uh, that you'd see in, uh, in some applications. So there's always a freshness to uh, the product, which makes a big difference uh, in the market. So again, you see just an ongoing example in this lookbook of different substrates, uh, different imagery and how it works together. And uh, we, just, we just couldn't be more exciting. And the technology continues to evolve. Uh, we're coming with, as you mentioned earlier, uh, newer generation spectrum uh, combinations that allow for even more advanced curing, uh, more efficient curing, uh, that can also reduce the cost of some of the consumables in the process. Uh, but the most amazing thing is just the value that LED can add to the offset industry and how fast it can do that on existing machinery. And uh, we're super excited. We have this lookbook now that's uh, been here for uh, just a few days. Uh, this is the, the newest printing of it, and uh, we have a limited set of copies here at the print show in Chicago, but we'll be uh, taking requests to send them out to uh, interested uh, printers around the world um, uh, as soon as possible, and uh, we're happy to distribute this. We work with great designers uh, and uh, fantastic customers of ours that help us produce this, uh, so we're very excited, and uh, for them it's a, it's a very exciting project to be involved in as well.